As of today, many concert and theater venues in California can reopen for business, but there are still some restrictions that you need to be aware of. KTV's Tom Vakar is here now and tells us what he learned from people who schedule venues for everything from weddings to mega concerts. Tom? Indeed, you know, we took a good look at the rules, the reality, and the real zeal to get back to booking events, big ones and small ones. As of April 15th, the opening of venues is now permitted, limited only by the restrictions of the tier color of the county the venue is in. Yeah, you know you're safe and sanitized and healthy and everything, then why not be out and do all the things that you're normally able to do? Right now, most folks we met appear wary. I still hope people proceed with caution because, you know, not everybody is, is on the same level in terms of vaccinations. As long as everyone's kind of being safe about it, wearing their masks like they're supposed to, I think it should be fine. As of June 15th, assuming no surges or vaccine shortages, venues are essentially wide open. It's not necessarily a free-for-all. We can open at 100% capacity, but there still may be mask requirements, vaccination requirements. Wedding planner Amy Ulkotekin is also president of the California Association for Private Events. The first day that weddings, birthday parties, graduation celebrations, bar mitzvahs, baby showers, all of those events are technically allowed in the state. And this is a huge win for our industry because it helps to propel us back to work and get us going for the summer. It's also about overall confidence. So now those couples who are getting married, those people who are planning galas, fundraisers, everything under the sun, have that confidence that they know they're not going to have to cancel or postpone moving forward. Matt Altman is a New York City-based international major events booker for corporations and wealthy clients. It's most importantly, seeing what the localized environment is. It really becomes a state-by-state -state question. Are the days of massive crowds in huge venues back? The confidence level at that level, we're, we're not there yet. He expects a gradual build back for the rest of this year. Then come the spring of next year, this time next year, it's going to be full on and there's going to be that mass opening that we're talking about. But the days of nothing goes, well, they're really quickly fading behind us. One more note, you may not realize this, but in California, the event industry employs 93,000 different companies, single companies to big companies, 3 million employees. Tom Vakar, KTVU, Fox 2 News. All right, Tom, thank you.